It's that time of the year again when shoppers fill the stores in a bit of a present panic. The countdown to Christmas is on and it's a mad dash to get those last minute presents under the tree. Some of us have to work for a living, you know. We have to work, so you know, you utilize the best time of opportunity, time management that you can, so here I am. I just finished teaching, so you know, the end of the school year was on the 18th and just been so busy that I just finally got around to it. But scoring those deals may be a bit harder this year due to the pandemic. With longer checkout lines, <laughs> and stores enforcing COVID-19 safety guidelines. There's just no precedent that has been set for what we are experiencing um, would be the biggest challenge that we've had. So a lot of things are just reacting, you know, to um, what's occurring in the moment. And if you want your gifts by the 25th, it may be too late to order online. Now you're going to have to mask up and hit the stores in person. Online stuff now, you know, the last few years I've had issues and something's been breached and now i got to change my debit card and so forth or credit cards. So it's, it's just much, much to me, it's much easier in person. Creating crowds most retailers were trying to avoid. A lot of focus has been placed on online shopping in order to reduce crowds and to help with social distancing. So Target has done an incredible job with promoting online sales and that sort of thing. If you want to avoid the crowds completely, check to see if your favorite stores have in-store or curbside pickup. Both are very popular methods at many stores, especially here at Target. In fact, the company says it's seeing an over 200% increase in pickup services this year. We're such a fast-paced world, and so they're able to supplement their life with these types of options, and it's worked out incredibly well for all involved. Using a new feature on Google Maps, it shows you how crowded a store may be in real time, making it easier to limit your in-person contact. Reporting in Harker Heights, Paige Ellenberger, 25 News.